James, Sam, and Dad woke up in the forest. It was James's first time camping, and he loved it. In so Ann fast. Simpson's first grade class, students are experiencing a read aloud before they work with a decodable text. The purpose is to analyze high frequency words and decodable words, and to help students develop letter sound connections, as well as reading comprehension skills. It's time to hear a story, a story, a story. It's time to hear a story and say what you've learned. All right, so I have a story for you. To set purpose and pique students' interest about the topic, the teacher reads aloud an engagement text. So they walk along a path next to a wide... An engagement text is a complex text with an interesting story. What we're going to do right now is I want you to use these pictures and I want you to remember the movie you made in your head and I want you to turn to your neighbor and you are going to retell the story. I want you to say what happened in the beginning, what happened in the middle, and what happened in the end. Go ahead. Now, tell me, Cecilia, why was James on this camping trip? James on, was on the camping trip because it was his first time camping and um, she was really excited. Once students comprehend the story, the teacher introduces and analyzes high-frequency words in the text that students will not be able to decode. Next. Good. So watch me. This is a word that doesn't play fair because it doesn't say what we think it's supposed to say. So watch me. Ready? What? What does it sound like that A is actually saying? Uh-huh. Uh-oh. It sounds like an O, but it's not. It's an A. Can you believe that? That's why it doesn't play fair. Now, who can use want in a sentence for me? Daria. I want a cookie. Oh. <laughs> me One more. One more with this. After looking at each high-frequency word, Anne introduces the decodable text and the final part of the practice the partner search and read. Now you're gonna read a story, but your story is going to have these high frequency words that we just worked on, but it's also gonna have words with parts that we have been working on all week. We're gonna spend just a couple minutes. Once you get it, you can go ahead and take a look and see if you can find those words that you know. The purpose of the decodable text is for students to apply the specific letter sound patterns they have learned in a given cycle in a text that they can read. Take one last look for those high frequency words. After students have identified the high frequency words individually, they then read the entire text with a partner to develop automaticity with the words in the text. Mine's all wide. I can see. I can hide. I can hide, says James. I want to see a cave, says James. I want to see boom, says Sam. Before continuing on with the lesson, Anne places the high frequency words on the class's word wall. here. What did you learn today to make yourself an even better reader than you were before? Lewis. Um, I sounded the words out. What helped you do that? I forgot the words that you put up there. Mm -hmm. I forgot one. I accidentally said it was when. What, what helped you remember what the word was? The, the word that you wrote down on land. When we worked on our high frequency words together, I'm so happy that that helped you. So happy.